to appeal the gag order, Ali. Okay, so here's the thing. For, for those of us who don't follow it as closely as you do, these gag orders seem to be about disparaging things that Donald Trump and his team might say about witnesses, court staff, um, people in potential jurors, people involved in the case. Why does this one, why is the Trump uh, team arguing that this is somehow material to Donald Trump's testimony or what he can say on the stand? Why is Judge Angoran's clerk relevant to to the outcome of this this case so i'll give you their version of events judge angoran's principal law clerk has been a candidate for office here in new york judge angoran himself is an elected official an elected supreme court judge here in new york their argument is that her involvement and in partisan politics here in new york necessarily makes her a biased actor and that coupled with the fact that she sits next to judge angoran on his bench and has been repeatedly seen either talking to him and undetectable whispers, passing notes to him. They've accused her of rolling her eyes at them, yelling at them, speaking at them in ways that they characterize as disrespectful. According to them, that makes this entire proceeding infected with bias. As for why this matters before the expiration of the trial, Team Trump would say they're entitled to make a record prior to the appeal and uh, basically memorialize what they see as these indicias of bias while the trial is going on. I'm not sure why it is that during the course of this trial, he needs to be able to say that. It would seem to me that they've already preserved their objection to that, Ali, on appeal. Mm -hmm. They can continue to do that once the appeal starts. But to them, they are characterizing this as a matter of core political speech. And the politics of this, I think, says everything, right? This is a core political speech act, according to them, and he has a right to defend himself against her political bias. But really what this is about is about appealing to their base and being able to blame what they see as the likely outcome of this trial on someone else, and chiefly the judge's principal law clerk. This idea, Tara, of, of speech uh, is one that comes up in every, uh, every piece of litigation that Donald Trump is involved in. Uh, the